Hey guys, this is Miss Middleton. Um, I'm sorry you can't be here for this river sediment lab. Um, what I have set up here is part two of your sediment lab. Um, and what you see is this is at a more intense angle. It's about at 20 degrees. And you'll see that there's definitely sediment within it. This is considered the headwaters where the river would start. Um, and because it's steeper, you're gonna have a more um, straight cut channel there. It will, once it gets to this lower angle, once it comes off the mountain and there's a lower angle here down at the bottom, you're gonna have more meanders in your river and it's not gonna be moving as quickly. So what we're gonna be doing, and you'll see there's some sand packed in there, is we're gonna slowly pour water down into our river from the headwaters and we're going to try and watch what happens to the sediment as it flows down from the headwaters towards the mouth of the river. Let's do it. Alright. Ew, that's real gross looking. That's real gross. Okay, hold off for a second. Let's let this run through. Mabes. So the water's coming down. It moves the sediment out of the way. Water's moving through our meandering area very slowly. The water's moving much slower here. see it is still carrying sediment but it's much slower perfect all right and what you might notice is that there's areas where the water is going to move faster and it's moving more of the sediment and then slower around the bends and it's going to deposit some of the sediments So we're going to pick up the speed of our river here. Oy. Get that out. And again, this is beautiful right here. I don't know if you can see it from the glare. But around the inside of the bends, the water moves slower. So it's going to deposit sediments right there. On the outside, it's kind of bouncing off the bank here and it's gonna erode away here. So you can see right on this bend, on the outside, it's wearing away. And this is how meanders get more and more bendy over time. Let's see if any of the other ones are doing it. Yeah, right there, perfect. So it deposits on the inside because the water doesn't have to go as fast. On the outside of the meander, it's gonna erode away. So inside it deposits sediment because it's slower on the, the inside outside it's going to be wearing away at that all right so that is how sediment moves here it's just weathering away actually it's cleaned itself out completely here it's going to as it goes along the outside it's going to wear away and erode it on the inside it's going to deposit sediments this is going to make the meanders more and more bendy as time goes on all right